Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Hellblusser. This is a first it's actually no, more appropriately, it is described as a hot first person <laughs> action roguelike from Sock Pop, which you may know they put out tons of little games all the time. But I, I'm excited to check it out because the just the visual style is interesting. I kinda wanted to play a first person roguelike just kind of is what I wanted to go for right now. So let's check it out together. There's it's got like 9 reviews. Let's let's vet another game, gang. For the past centuries, the moon has been sleeping. Wake up, moon. But evil is at hand. And she has to wake up. As far, far below her, a big fire is spreading. Oh no. The moon sends a champion. <laughs> a young, arrogant prince with a burning desire to extinguish hell. <laughs> All right. Normal or... Ooh. Let's go. Okay. Sewer 1 encounter. I am... I am so excited. This is... Yeah. The, I'll be honest. The uh, the hand thing is what really sent me on this. The mouse sensitivity. For the first time in any game ever, I think I am turning down... Oh my god. For the first time in any game ever, I am turning down the mouse sensitivity. Oh boy, it, it is neat. It is neat visually. Wobble effect off, camera motion off. I have just, I am oft nauseous. Oh my God. Yeah, just the visual style of it and that hand, how it's always out is so funny to me. Found a coin, you better hold on to it. Can we like do something with this? Hello? Fire is dangerous, absorb it by holding right mouse button. You absorb fire. Shoot it by pressing right mouse button. <laughs> so I can absorb... Okay, is there any way I can take whatever that is? Oh, we got a monster of some kind. Attack by pressing left mouse button. Block by holding left mouse button and S. Oh, interesting. It's almost like fighting game style there. So yeah, that's kind of... We, we can't... Uh, uh, whoa! Attack while moving backwards very much. There's no... S oh, found a tear. Some enemies shed them when defeated, of course. But yeah, we can't really... Uh, can't attack while walking backwards, but... Yeah? I mean, does that... I've made a mistake. I have made a mistake. Blast him. We have a kick. <laughs> Look at the kick. Get out of here. Get out of here! So the kick does not do damage. Okay, so he's defending. Kick damage. Wow, this is... <laughs> I mean, this is actually kind of slick. I'm going to turn down the uh, the sounds just a little bit, and then I promise we are done with dinking around with settings after that. Oh, my God. That br that that big screen flash of uh, a pink-red there is wild. Hello? I want to- I just want to stick my hand- do I have a button to stick my hand out further? But yeah, this- this is definitely like a visual style that I feel like I haven't really seen. It's... Like, it's kind of interesting. You back up. Look at that. The, the hallway is just a- it's just a muddied- muddied section of thick lines. Like... But it kind of does a good job of either accidentally or on purpose simulating the darkness and the fact that we really can't see that far ahead. It's like... I don't know if it's on purpose, but it kind of works out that way, huh? Doesn't it? Oh, we got... Hell Blusse! This whole, like, catching and throwing of the, uh, of the fire is such an interesting mechanic as well. Like, being the kind of almost mana and spell system. I feel like I'm a firebender. Boop, boop, boop. Drop tears in the fountain to get blessed by the moon. 
Olympic Flame, higher movement speed, three health when reaching zero health only triggers once. I feel like a second chance seems like a good call. Man, just so, so, so much uh, adjusting I want to do here. Gimme! All right, but hey, you know, the fact that they have all the, all them options, all those settings, I'm happy about it. So we get, now we get to go back to, that's right, we had a, look at that guy. We go back to like the, the Slay the Spire FTL style map here. In we go. But yeah, it's just like a, it's just a little game. So if you're not familiar with Sock Pop, they, uh, they put out just tons, tons of games. You can only hold three fires, shoot some to make room. Tons, tons, tons of games. And they're all like, they, they, they're very varied. They had this other game that I want to check out where it's, uh, it's an MMO that takes place entirely, oh, in a chat room, for example. Like, basically, what if those forums where you roll, oh, ah, you role played that you were a, a Pokemon or whatever. And you fought each other. What if it was real and actually there were systems to, to actually make it work? Or a frisbee golf game or all these kinds of different games that they've got. It's just... Oh, boy. Just to kind of prop properly clarify what the hell you're even looking at here. Whoop! Oh, my God. We're at one health here. We do have that second chance, thankfully, which... I think we're maybe going to want... I don't trust you. Can I take that from over here? We can. Good. But I like that it also drops it on the ground. It's kind of like an arrow system. Kind of like a... It, it, as long as we properly pick up the fire again quick enough. It just kind of is like... Oh, that's not an enemy. It's kind of reusable. It's sort of a nifty little simple basis that actually provides some uh, dynamic ranged gameplay I like it I dig it I like it I dig it I'm curious to see what kind of upgrades we might have in this game here we only have the one health and that flashing up there is is driving me man steal that back so if we hit the enemy we don't get the fire anywhere that we see the fire we can absorb it it seemed like let's go back and get a couple back here we don't like don't even need to be that close Oh, he, oh my god, I missed. <laughs> One, two, three. Hello there. Get him. Dang it. All right, we got him. All right, take the fire with us. We're on fire. Can we extinguish our own fire? Like, if we get lit on fire... Get away. If we get lit on fire, is that something that we can... Uh, Extinguish just by holding right click just anywhere. We don't need no more. All right, what do you got? Minus two max health, but plus one damage output on all attacks. Faster melee. I feel like this one just has no downside. Oh, baby. I am cutting off my own fingers on my left hand. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I want to see this man. I want to see this man right now. I want to see this man walking down the hallway. How is this possible? Hey, 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 hey. This is a dance. This is not a fight. Oh, my God. Boop. Oh boy. Two tears. So theoretically, I guess we maybe could rest or shop. I gotta be honest, a rest sounds smart. Rest, ready, set, go. You can rest near the fire to regain health. Okay, anything in these? Look, maybe we can get a little bit of, uh, yeah extra coins when we make it to the shop we will be absolutely stocked loaded whoop is that a man like a goblin man there's a ghost here too 
Okay. Absorb that fire over there. Hello, goblin man. Oh, he's throwing something. We. Oh my god. Hey, what on earth? Do you see him go? Look at that. Ah. Uh, <laughs> this is so. It is so darn stylized. It is bonkers. I, I, there's just, there's something just innately humorous about the game, you know? Hello. Just something about the, just every part of the game. It just has just this gentle, whimsy and irreverent kind of, uh, humor to it. That I think is on purpose, right? Like, I think that it's on purpose. Like, we're, our goal is to extinguish hell. I mean, like, that's gotta be... Gotta be known that that's kind of a, a funny little thing. You found a key, now to find the door. Bop, bop, bop. Do we have a map? The levels are so small and self-contained that I I would say that it's probably not as likely that I really we really need a map. Get wrecked! We're actually starting to aim properly. With our, uh, with our shots here, go figure. Where you at, rat? Wait, where did you go? Did you die? Did the rat die somehow? I have no idea. Wait, wait! Kick my- yeah, you better believe I, uh, know about that. Okay. Oh, look at him go. Yeah. Kick, 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 kick. Fireball, fireball. Oh my God. That actually, why, why does such a simple combat system feel so good? It's like, there is absolutely enough here to give the combat some depth. I can't attack in midair already? You're right. He's not he's telling the truth. Okay, I wanna I wanna check out a shop. Desperately. We have zero tears. Sewer 5 encounter. Sewer 5. This leads me to believe that this is just one type of floor and that there's a second one after. And it's... Don't heal some health. Okay, well, I mean, I'm at full. Let's not go back. Fair enough. Beep. We got some bats. Got some bats up in there as well. But yeah, just like... Having a... Such a deeply ingrained, uh, ranged combat system is super neat. Like, it's- it, it feels like the thing that you'll want to be doing, you know? And I've just also realized how big of a deal one extra sword damage is, since we only do one damage. Up. Ah! <laughs> like, it's- it could have just as easily said, double your damage, you know? Just as easily could have said that, and it would have been equally as true. What do we get? Just got... We got a key. Okay. So the chest always has a key, I think. Right? Is that is that what I'm gathering here? <laughs> Trying to break all these so that I know which path we have and have not gone down. <laughs> I see you barely there, bat. Get wrecked, get wrecked. Okay. Why is everything just on fire? Are we in hell? Is this hell? Is that why it needs to be extinguished? For some reason, I just wouldn't have guessed that this is hell. It seems fairly, uh, fairly tame. Ooh, 
Whoop. We barely even entered the room and the man's dead. Thank you for the donut. Can we go above six health? Okay. I think maybe perchance we can. Ah, uh, tears are needed. We've finally not had enough when we've entered. Do we get the three? Cool. Out we go. Through the shop. Just in case we can't go above six. Hi, you can spend coins in the shop to buy equipment. Hello. Look at him just super slowly move to the other side. Hello. Drain blade. 10% chance to heal one when defeating enemies. That's pretty good. Enemies have slightly more trouble detecting you. I don't have that much problem with that right now. Explosive ring. Enemies explode when defeated. Is that good? I don't know. 20% chance to gain fire. You know what? That feels more fun. Let's buy that. You know what? Also, let's make enemies explode. Oh, look at it. It goes on. We actually... You know what? Hell yeah. We actually did get a visual change there. I'm hoping the explosion does not hurt me. But I'm pretty prepared for it to do so. But it's it's such a melee-focused game. Like, aside from the, uh, the fire, everything is melee, so... I just love seeing that ring on, too. It's so funny. Okay, did we gain any fire back by killing? Wait, do we have to... We, maybe we have to kill him with the sword. That would actually make sense. I love that they bounce and have that little sound effect that they do as well. Yeah, does it have to be with the sword to get the fire back? That I don't know. That I don't know. Oof. We killed him and then the fire thing lit up over there. So it looked like that would have been a time where we would have gotten it. We would have gotten the fire if we didn't already have the max. Huh. Where'd we go? That's where the chest was, I think. Do we go down here? Hello, boys. I don't know. Maybe this sword... I, I feel like the health thing would have been better. But, you know, I just... just want to lean into the uh, the goofiness and the, the fire-focused nature of the game here. Come on. Oh, we got one fire. Hey! Beep, beep, beep. Get out of here. Oh, yeah, we could just, like, play a lot of uh, defensive game here and then shoot out the fireballs and try and just poke in only when we need to. Beep, beep, beep. You poor sap. You absolute poor sap. We could do a lot of... Uh, Kicking into fireballs. <laughs> we just kicked the rat in the face! We need to aim a lot higher than you'd think as well. One health... One, wait, gain a fire when damage minus two max health, but plus one damage output. You know what? Sure. Let's... As said, let's like super lean into the fire mechanics here. I'm, I'm very excited to see what a boss fight in this game looks like. All right. I mean, maybe it's not a boss fight even. Oh, it's a boss. There's what are these cannons? It's the Rat King. He's immune. Does he need to be fire blasted exclusively? Oh. What? I was thinking maybe we had to, like, um... 
parry it at him or something? Maybe we need to slice it at him? I have no freaking clue. Or wait. Wait. Maybe we have to... Uh, we have to light it up and fire at him. Oh my god. That's so cool. That's so clever. So he's going here. So we got to light up this one. Ah! That is very clever. Okay. Okay, we got him. Where's he going? <laughs> That's a neat little fight. That's a neat little fight that very heavily leans on like the gimmicks of the uh, of the game. I. You know, I like that. That's very, very clever. Very clever indeed. Oof. I'm in danger now, though, of course. Ooh, to the dungeon. I need health. I need it. Give a donut. Give me donut. I guess we can just kind of like... I like that we can just wildly shoot out our fire. Are you, you actually, are you immune to fire? Okay. And we have to chase them down while they're doing all that spinning and everything. What is that? Is he gonna like... Oh, I thought he was gonna just recuperate back into a man. A skeleton. man. Okay. If we attack fast enough, we can actually... Yeah. If we, yeah, since we have really fast swing speed, we can get in there and, uh, and get multi multiple attacks. So these are technically breakables. I don't know if they can have something. That, I'm sure that could. Bring it with me. Okay. I've not, yeah, I've not seen anything in one of those yet. I think that's a bat over there. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure I'm firing at a bat. Got to fire. I missed. Uh. Okay. Woo. Donut. No donut. Yep. Grant fire. Grant me fire. Oh, that's so nice. Yeah, getting them while they're vulnerable because of a, a ranged hit, like moving into then tr combo and try and chase them down while they're spinning away from you to get multi-strikes in after. It's such an elegant solution to making such simple combat interesting. I, I That was obviously the boss fight. I just, or, you know, the boss fight of the floor, but I don't feel quite ready for it with two health and no fire, but I guess we're just going to go. I do something with that. Okay. Ooh, what? What? Don't know what that's about. But I can't get it. What? Okay, so you did multiple. Ugh. Okay. I'm ready for you. Chase him down, chase him down, chase him down. Woo! One, two, three. Hey, 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 hey! You thought you had me? No! Bye. 
Whew. It's tight. Melee weapon shoots fire when on one health. Oh, that's kind of fun. 5% chance. Wait, 5% chance? Wasn't it 10% before? Guess not. That's so fun, though. I gotta do it. I don't care. I don't care. Oh, boy. Off we go. Can I... Oh. There we are. Probably shouldn't just be absorbing stuff when we're at full. It's like, at its very nature, it's a waste. Okay. There's like a yeah. There's a finite amount of fi oops fire attacks. Hello. That we can do. So we should make sure we're not just oops just wasting them as well. And breaking things on fire. It's an interesting trade off too. It's a, it's a very like simple trade off to have to make mentally, where you're like, do I want to sacrifice my ability to potentially use that for mana? So that I might get, I might possibly get like money or health. It's very, it's a very, it's a very simple game that I'm actually like, I'm really respecting in its simplicity. And the, uh, the amount at which it likes to play around this one mechanic of the fire, really making it. And it's 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 the very core. It's what the it's what makes it stand out. Aside from the obvious, very like funny, goofy, silly visuals, you know, of the main character. Uh, heck. Yep. Okay, I think we can actually get you in a corner and we might be able to wombo combo you because you're so big. Hey! Yes! Good stuff. That was close. That was close. Ba ba da boop boop boop. So, is this just like visual fire or maybe we'll get the ability to absorb that somehow? Maybe that's like an ability we can get. We get a choice of shop now. You know, I like I like the idea that we did last time, which was rest first while we stockpile more money to get something even cooler at the shop. You know what I'm saying? I think that that's I think that's logical because we're I think that we're gonna get the same option where we get either a health or a shop later. But the thing is, it's not a waste. By skipping a shop, we're not skipping items. We're skipping choices on which items we get. For the sake of coming back... What the dang? Yep. We can just go in wombo combo. Hey! Go, go, go! Uh, okay, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Oh, that was not. Getting a little silly with it. Just want them to stop healing. Does the ghost have to be killed via fire? We just we've just always killed the ghost via fire conveniently. That's tough because it's a it's a floating enemy. They're not as easy to hit with that attack. Oh, I it's, I wonder how many times I've uh, actually gotten a rat in in a, a crate like that, and I just didn't know yet. Fast attack speed is busted. Oh, because we can stop a lot of enemies before they start their attack. 
And grouping them up like that can be pretty good too, because boom, they can explode, and it looks like the explosion does at least two damage, which is pretty nice. This is a, this is a satisfying little loop. It's a satisfying, straightforward, elegant little little loop, is what this son of a gun does right here. This game, hell, blue sir. Boop. Boop. I always like the spirit of what Sock Pop does. And whenever I, I feel like, I want to talk about something real quick. I want to use the, this is a great, this is a great uh, format of a game, and Sock Pop is the perfect uh, development crew to have this discussion over. Like, uh, among with uh, like Punk Cake, uh, who we played like Metavax and uh, uh, the Rashes Den recently. I want to support the idea of these sort of like smaller scope potential ideas and like, you know, them just experimenting with ideas and then like, and then just allowing, allowing themselves to move on to, so, to something else. I, I like that. And I want to, I want to support that because everybody, you know, like it's... Not every game needs to be the thousand hour game. Not every game needs to be the hundred hour hundred hour game. There's something really special about just like really letting yourself hone in on an idea, execute it, and then letting yourself uh, move to the next thing. On and it creating a smaller self-contained experience that's not supposed to be played for a hundred hours. Like I want to support that, and that's like that's kind of my my thought process where. Was like, hey, I, it's fun to see that like Sock Pop made a made a roguelike, because like, I like a lot of the stuff they do, but not a lot of the stuff they do are roguelikes. Uh, so it's just very fitting for my channel here, where I thought people would be more interested in checking it out as a result of it being a roguelike. Um, and uh, hey, I I'm liking it. I'm liking it quite a bit. It's it's just a nice, elegant little game. How replayable is it? I don't know. I don't know. But what's here is really, really, oh, it's really, really, uh, it's like, it's, it's redirect. I didn't even know that was a thing. It's really, really special. I like it. Redirect. What? So we pretty much have to melee this guy, but he's a little bit more, oh. Yep, 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 yep. Get him in the corner, get him in the corner. Oh, no, that was my bad. I got greedy. Oh, there we go. We can wombo combo. To... We can kind of, like, get a ricochet wombo combo going with him off the wall if we are at the right distance away. Yeah, you see that? We we can line him up in the right spot. We can play ping pong using his body. It's amazing. I'm, oh, I'm crazy. Why not? Why not, man? Boop. All right, we got the shop coming up next. We're getting to the point where we, we probably would want to heal, theoretically. Oops. But, oh well. Okay, get him. Get him. How big is that explosion? It's not that big. Grab it. Blast it. Oop. Beep. Grab it. Blast it. Nice. Yeah. I'm liking the fire focus build. I feel like I'm truly leaning into the game when I'm doing that, you know? When I'm when I'm playing around with the fire as the core component. Yeah, he's immune to fire. That son of a gun, man. Wombo him. I would say that uh, I wish that the block had its own key. Uh-oh. We're we're maybe gonna die. Uh-oh. But at the same time, look at that. We still have our, um, our extra life. So we're not in as much danger as it looks. And with our attack speed up and the fight... Oh my god! I have, uh, I have realized my true form. I'm busted, dude. That's where we came from. Yes! Yes! Oh, there's a donut. All right. Easy come, easy go. But you know what? We'll get back to one HP. I promise you that. 
I don't have any fire. Just wanted to keep kicking him, or keep, uh, speaking of kicking. Just wanted to keep slapping, mostly for the, uh, ability to just stop him, you know, for a little bit. It's more like a, using it as a stun, basically, more or less. I cringe at how many boxes he left in game I've never played. I just cringe. All right. Uh, we have the key. Man, this is gonna be it. Uh, you're immune to fire, right? Well, the guy behind you wasn't. Oop! Oh. Wombo, 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 wombo! Oh! Wombo number five! Oh my! Wait, it's gonna be an ex chain reaction explosion if we kick him back into the skeleton. Nice. Big. Alright, back it up. Fire blast. We can't kill the skeleton, but we can kill everybody else with it. And that's the thing, as busted as this is. Yeah, we can't kill him with it. Come here. Yeah, throw something at me. Uh! I'm on fire! Oh my god. We need to get rid of all this fire on the ground, but we can't. Hey, hey, hey! I wish the range that we would pick up stuff would be a little bit bigger. As well, but yeah. Uh, the fact that I can't back up and throw fireballs easily because it makes me do do this is a weird situation that I, I guess is unique. It's unique to this exact setup. Hello, boss. Bye, boss. Okay. Items in the shop are cheaper. Hey. Just in time for us to go. Because I'm not going to heal. I'm going full fire. Because we are going to be wrapping up the video very shortly here. So, why not, man? To the shop. To the shop. Cloak of Sadness. Shed a tear when damaged. Uh, one max health, but more knockback. When damaged, deal one to the attacker. Higher attack speed, but can't block. Let's go! If we click too fast, we do this. But there we go. If we... I like what I've done. Yeah, let's just leave. Eh. Yeah. Fine, I'll buy it. Sure. I it might end up. You know, we might heal. Then it matters. Sure, cool, fine. I just hope that the boss is not fire immune. I am absolutely disgusting. Look at this. We are leaving a lot of fire on the ground, though. Oh my god. This is gnarly. Wait, can't block? Maybe it just doesn't do anything. I healed. <laughs> I don't want to be at full health. I want to end by full life too. As if that's anything. Alright. But that was a good interpretation of how long we truly do need to be in fire. But the thing is, it looks like it doesn't need to be the same fire. As long as we're in fire for a, that rough distance, or amount of time, we're going to be in, in Problemsville. I'm truly absolutely busted. That guy's immune, though. 
Kill everybody else in the meantime. What the hell has just happened? I love it. Get out of here. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> the amount of times like the screen uh, does that that stutter frame because we've hit something. It's so high because we we just keep hitting things all the time, 24/7. Infinite hitting something. He's immune. That's a problem because we, we can't block. Can we knock him out of the door? That would probably... We wouldn't want that, though. Obviously. Um, we can probably, like, knock him back in a spot where we would be able to get in and actually hit him without consequence because of the fact that he's in Finna stunned from the fire. I did it! I guess we'll just do that one, because I don't want the other one. All right, let's go in. We shall uh, we shall defeat this second dungeon at best, and then we will uh, we will call it here for the day. Uh, as much as I am, I'm very much enjoying myself. I once again have found myself uh, at a little bit stricter of a time limit than I have been for the let's tries here for today. So let's savor it. Looks like I'm cowering in fear. <laughs> no! What? The... What? What is happening? He is immune to fire. Of course he is. Can I hit- can I actively hit him? Am I doing damage? Is this something? What am I doing? Do I need to hit you? You don't have a health bar. What do I do? Not taking damage. Can't absorb that fire. Why does it look? It really looks like I'm doing one damage to him. did damage. Why did I do damage? Did I reflect one back at him? I don't get it. I don't get it! What am I missing? I can't hit it back, can I? No, is it just I did one damage to him because uh Huh. What's wrong with you? Can I like Am I supposed to kick him into his father? I did one damage because I got hit, didn't I? That's like what my thing does. I can't wait, I, wait, no. I took damage again. What is, what is happening? I really feel like I'm supposed to be able to do something with this fire.
I really feel like I'm supposed to be able to do something with it. But it won't let me pick it up. We're doing damage to him because we have that thing that makes it so we... No, we don't have something that makes us... Oh, it's our ring. Our ring is like, do damage when we get hit, right? We only have so many things we can do. He shoots out a big batch of... Big batch of fire. Wait. His left eye is... What happened? One of his eyes was... Do I steal the fire from his eyes? What? Oh my god. That's gnarly. What? <laughs> well, at least we learned at the last second. I can steal the fire out of his eyeballs. Oh... Hey, that's that, though. And that is going to do it here for today. For Hellblusser. This. This was, a, this was an experience. This was a trip. And I enjoyed it. Uh, I enjoyed it greatly. Look at this. What the hell, man. Uh, let me take a quick gander. I tabbed out for a second. This is... $4.99. This is $4.99 on Steam with the link at the top of the description. If you want to pick it up for yourself, I highly recommend checking out... Uh, if you go over to the Steam page, also clicking Sock Pop uh, over in the upper right, you know, where the developer, the developer publisher thing, I highly recommend clicking them and just checking out their massive catalog of, of wild, smaller, you know, some of them are bigger, some of them are smaller, but generally kind of smaller, more uh, just tiny bite-sized fun little fun little games highly recommended checking that out but this has been hell blow sir i would love uh, i would love to check this out a, a little bit more it was a, a very pleasant pleasant time again what's the replayability like i don't know but i don't know if that's really like the thing i don't know if that's really the point i i don't know i don't think that this is supposed to be a roguelike that you just play over and over again i i think that it's just you start over, you get the different upgrades, you try and beat it a couple times, you know, maybe there's, it looks like there's the uh, the harder mode potentially that gets unlocked as well. So that is that, that's going to do it for today. Check it out with the link at the top of the description. My name is Retromation, I put out videos on new indies every single day that you might otherwise miss. So, especially if you like roguelikes, especially, especially if you like roguelikes, definitely, definitely subscribe to this channel. New indies every day. Again, you might miss them. If you're not, if you're not subscribed here, you might miss them. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.